Welcome back to Techverse PH. So, uh, in this lecture series, ituturo ko sa inyo ang isa sa mga fundamentals and basic topics na kailangan matutunan ng students na nagtitake ng IT-related course. So, uh, before we start, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to uh, Techverse PH. So, let's start. Ang number system ay ginagamit para i-represent ang mga data natin sa ating computer. So, may mga ilan tayong mga number system na pwedeng gamitin. At uh, i-discuss natin sila isa-isa ngayon. But, uh, let's start with decimal number system. Uh, in decimal number system, ito ay uh, gumagamit ng uh, 10 digits. So, from 0 to 9. So, ito yung mga combination ng values na pwede natin gamitin representing a decimal number. So, ito ay sinusulat uh, with a subscript of 10. Kasi nga, 10 digits ang pwede natin gamitin in representing a decimal number. So, we have example 12 uh, sub 10. 350 subscript 10 and 3.2 subscript 10. So these are example of decimal number kasi uh, gumamit lang tayo ng subscript to represent that this is a decimal number. So let's have uh, an example para nang ma-prove na ito ay gumagamit ng base 10. So gagawa tayo ng simple computation. So for example, we are given of 7203 na decimal number. Ang sabi, the decimal equivalent is the sum of product of each digit in decreasing power of 10. So, isa-isayin natin ang mga digits natin. So, we have 7, 2, 0, and 3. So, ang gagawin natin, kukunin natin ang product or sum product ng bawat digits at uh, with a decreasing power of 10. Ang 3 natin will be the units place. 0 is the tens place, 2 is the hundreds place, and 7 is the thousands place. So, kung yung multiply natin sila sa ating uh, decreasing power of 10, so, mangyayari niyan is 3 times 10 raised to 0, 0 times 10 raised to 1, 2 times 10 raised to 2, and 7 times 10 raised to 3. So, ang uh, magiging value natin, this is 3, ito ay 0, Ito ay 200 and this is 7,000. And then, kukunin lang natin yung uh, pinaka-sum ng bawat value natin. So, 7,000 plus 200 plus 0 plus 3. The total is 7,203. So, makakita natin na equal sila. So, na-prove natin na ang decimal uh, number system ay gumagamit ng base 10. Let's have another example. So, same process. Uh, nagagawin natin. For example, given tayo ng 3, 4, 5, the decimal number. So, 3 times 10 raised to 2, 4 times 10 raised to 1, and then the last digit is 5 times 10 raised to 0. Again, decreasing number of power sa base 10 natin. So, 3 times 10 raised to 2 is 300, plus 4 times 10 raised to 1 is 4, Plus 5 times 10 raised to 0 is 5. So, ang pinaka-total natin is 3, 4, 5. So, equal sila. Okay? Next example natin is, uh, ano ang given value natin? 20.25. So, yung 20.25 natin, kung makapansin ninyo, is meron na tayong fractional value sa ating decimal given number. So, uh, same procedure. Ang tatandaan natin is yung 0 natin dito sa whole number natin is 10 raised to 0. And then kapag nagkaroon na tayo ng fractional value, magiging na siyang negative 1, negative 2, so on and so forth. So ang gagawin natin is 2 times 10 raised to 1 para doon sa ating uh, tens place plus 0 times 10 raised to 0. And then yung, yung fractional value naman natin, magiging na siyang negative 1. 2 times 10 raised to negative 1 plus 5 times 10 raised to negative 2. So, ang value natin dito, this is 20 plus 0 plus 0 0.2 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 plus 0 0
plus 0.05. So, ang pinaka-total value natin is 20.25. So, ibig sabihin pareho, na-prove natin na this is the operation para mapakita natin kung ano ang value ng isang decimal number, uh, given decimal number. Okay? So, next natin, kayo naman ang magsasagot para mas mag-practice ninyo kung uh, paano ginagamit at na-represent ang isang decimal number sa ating uh, computer.